You were just a dog, but a good dog right from the start. Your loyalty was never in question. And what you didn't know, you didn't know because I never took the time to teach you. When you were young, I was harder on you. I expected you to understand the basics and you learned them. A bad dog was like a whip on your back. But if an uncontrollable instinct got you in trouble, I didn't hold it against you. I doctored you up, changed your bed, and remembered that reason gets left behind in the heat of passion, be it skunks, gyps, or cloven hooves. You were patient with the young pups or kids. They pulled your hair, barked around you in circles, and rode on your back. You know, I never, I never had to worry. They were safe with you. A fierce guardian of your territory, you did the best you could to protect us. And I knew better to shout you down at two in the morning. I always figured you were barking for a reason. Well, old age was not unkind to you. Despite the hearing loss and the cataracts and the stiff joints, you carried on. Sure, I had to help you get in the pickup, but you were part of the crew. I noticed you ate less and slept late, turned gray, but you never lost your enthusiasm for being part of the outfit. People debate if dogs have a heaven. I'm not sure that matters. What is heaven to a dog? Enough to eat, something to chase, shade in the summer, and pay a little attention now and then. All I know is you added to our life. Companion, listener, guardian, and a connection to a part of nature that we tend to overlook because we're too busy worrying about the minutia of life. You reminded us to appreciate a sunny day, a bone to chew, and a, and a kind word. And you'll be missed around here. You were just a dog, but you'll be in my heaven. Rest in peace, old friend. This is Baxter Black from out there.